in this video we are going to understand about the concept of linear equation in one variable now you've seen in the earlier videos something about algebraic expressions minus 2. Now in all these cases we have certain variables. In this equation the variable is x. In this equation the variable is y. In this equation the variable is z. You also know that we have seen the concept of square which means say 5 square means 5 to the power 2 or 6 to the power 2 means 6 square and there are cubes 5 to the power 3 which means effectively 5 multiplied by 5 multiplied by 5 now in all these equations basically if you see the power of the variable which is there is 1 here also the power is 1 here again the power is 1 so in these types of equation where the power of the equation is 1 are known as linear equations in single variable. Why? Because basically the variable in this case is having the power of 1 unlike a square or a cube. So where the variable has a power of 1 we call it as a linear equation in one variable. So these are something which we are going to discuss in the few of the videos wherein we will understand in more detail the concept of linear equations. Now just to recall a little bit on the algebraic equation. Now an algebraic equation generally had a left hand side and a right hand side and in the middle there was an equation which was nothing but the equality sign. Now in a linear equation what used to happen was that the left hand side was always equal to the right hand side and therefore whether you add something, you subtract something, you multiply something or you divide something from both the sides. the results remained unchanged. So these are basically your algebraic equation that you had studied earlier. Now we will see some problems in the upcoming videos which will be solving the problem of linear equations in one variable. 